Josh from the Open Cesaris team, and I would like to show you how to run some example workloads on the freshly deployed adaptable Linux platform prototype. Uh, in this demo, we will use the probably most easy workload to start with, which is the YAST uh, Encurses container workload. Uh, we refer to workload as anything which is basically, um, let's say, a system component or application which is decoupled from base OS either in VM or container. In this case, we will be talking about container. In ideal way, it should be as seamless so user doesn't even realize that this is a container. Uh, at least for default system components, just like Yast, for example, we are used to use for uh, configuring your system. So um, we have a few few variants of Yast available: on the cute one, the web one, and the curses one. And we will start with the uncurses one because we don't have a graphical stack. We could though, use the web management one, but let's uh, let's go uh, easy for this first demo of workload execution. Uh, so let's click through, and then what you can do is podman search uh, just uh, management and curses that will show you the workload. It should take a few seconds. By the way, this is freshly deployed host. Uh, the difference is that I've started SSH and allowed root login, so I can copy paste easily rather than uh, typing everything through Word Viewer. Um, let's see. Good. So we want this one, and I can just copy paste the same command that they are running here. Then uh, in some workloads, there is already integration with the system. Uh, for example, with Podman, you would be able to use systemd actually to start the service. Here, um, I expect that in the future, the integration will be through user bin repress that will be probably deployed as RPMs, but it will vary per workload. Uh, for the pro uh, for the sake of prototype, we are just pulling the container from registry. Good. You can see that we don't have the image yet. The second execution would take literally one second. We can test it afterwards. And the cool thing about this is that you can actually manage your system through Yast, which is running in the in the con you know basically a separated layer, a container, but you are still managing the underlying system, not the container itself. So I will just quit really quickly with F9. And you can see that the second execution is already like super fast. Good, and that's pretty much it. Um, make sure to test more workloads that are referenced in the documentation or simply available in the SUSE Alp workload subproject in OBS. This is publicly accessible by everyone. Thank you very much for watching.